Have you ever wondered what could be the most terrifying thing in this colossal universe? Picture this, a cosmos so vast, so incredibly expansive that it's beyond human comprehension. We're talking about the universe, a seemingly endless expanse teeming with galaxies, stars, and planets. But within this vastness, there's an element of fear, an unsettling mystery that sends shivers down even the most stoic of spines. So what could it be? Let's dive into the most terrifying mystery that the universe holds. Scene script. Imagine a monster that devours everything, even light itself. Yes, we're talking about the black hole. The universe is full of wonders, and black holes are one of its most fascinating phenomena. So what exactly is a black hole? It's a region in space where the gravitational pull is so strong that nothing can escape it, not even light. Thus the term black hole. But how do these cosmic monsters form? They're born from stars, believe it or not. When a star at least 20 times the mass of our sun exhausts its nuclear fuel, it collapses under its own gravity, creating a supernova explosion. The core that remains after this explosion is so dense and heavy that it warps the fabric of space-time around it, forming a black hole. Now let's delve deeper into the heart of a black hole, where the real terror lies, the singularity. It's a point of infinite density, a one-dimensional dot where the laws of physics as we know them cease to apply. At the singularity, space and time warp and twist until they're indistinguishable. Wrapped around the singularity is the event horizon, the boundary beyond which nothing can escape the black hole's gravitational pull. It's like the point of no return. Cross it and you're doomed to fall into the singularity. And black holes aren't just cosmic vacuums. They can warp and distort the space around them. They can spin at nearly the speed of light, dragging space and time along with them in a phenomenon known as frame dragging. Black holes are the universe's ultimate enigma. They're places where our understanding of the cosmos breaks down, where the very fabric of reality is twisted and torn apart. Yet, they're also fascinating windows into the extremes of the universe. Indeed, black holes are a terrifying concept, but hold tight, there's something even more horrifying. Now picture this, a star, millions of times bigger than our sun, exploding in a blinding flash of light and energy. This is a supernova. These cosmic fireworks are not just mesmerizing spectacles of light and energy, they are the cataclysmic end of a star's life cycle. But what causes such a dramatic event? The answer lies in the heart of the star itself. When a star exhausts its nuclear fuel, it can no longer sustain the heat and pressure necessary to keep its massive outer layers from collapsing inward. The result? A violent explosion that outshines the star's entire galaxy for a brief, shining moment. This celestial explosion, known as a supernova, releases an astonishing amount of energy. Imagine, if you will, the energy output of our sun throughout its 10 billion year lifetime. Now multiply that by 100. That's the amount of energy a supernova can release in a mere matter of seconds. It's an energy output so colossal that it's hard to wrap our heads around it. Now, what happens when a supernova occurs near other celestial bodies? Well, the effects can be devastating. The shockwave from the explosion can obliterate any nearby planets, turning them into cosmic dust in the blink of an eye. The intense radiation can ionize gases millions of miles away, creating nebulae, vast glowing clouds of gas and dust. Yet despite their destructive power, supernovae play a crucial role in the universe. They seed the cosmos with heavy elements, elements that are necessary for the formation of planets and even life itself. So, in a way, we owe our very existence to these celestial explosions. However, as terrifying as a supernova may seem, it's not the most horrifying thing lurking in the depths of space. There are cosmic phenomena out there that are far more chilling, far more alien to our understanding. Supernovae are indeed destructive, but they're not the scariest thing out there. Now let's talk about something that's not a thing at all, the concept of absolute nothingness. The very mention of nothingness may seem paradoxical as the idea itself is inherently contradictory. How can we discuss or even think about something that doesn't exist? Yet this is exactly what we're about to do. We're going to dive into the concept of absolute nothingness, a concept that is, in essence, the absence of everything. Imagine a vast, limitless expanse with no matter, no energy, no light, no sound, no time, and no space. 
This is the vacuum of space, the quintessential representation of absolute nothingness. It's not just empty, it's devoid of everything we know and understand about our universe. It's not just the absence of things, it's the absence of existence itself. The concept of nothingness is not just a physical idea, but it also has profound philosophical and existential implications. Philosophically, many have grappled with the concept of nothingness, trying to understand what it truly means. Does nothingness exist? Can it exist? These are questions that have puzzled thinkers for centuries and continue to do so today. Existentially, the concept of nothingness can be deeply unsettling. It challenges our understanding of our own existence. We are creatures of matter and energy, living in a world filled with light, sound, and time. The concept of nothingness, the absolute absence of all these can be terrifying. It's like staring into an abyss that not only doesn't stare back, but doesn't even exist to begin with. In the grand scheme of the universe, we are but tiny specks of matter and energy. The universe is vast, and much of it is filled with this absolute nothingness. It's a stark reminder of our insignificance in the grand cosmic play, a humbling thought that can be both awe-inspiring and terrifying at the same time. So when we talk about the most terrifying thing in the universe, it's not a thing at all. It's the concept of absolute nothingness. So we've journeyed through black holes, supernovae, and even the concept of nothingness. We've explored the gravitational pull of black holes, the destructive power of supernovae, and the mind-bending notion of absolute nothingness. But out of all these cosmic phenomena, it's the concept of nothingness that truly sends shivers down our spine. It's the idea of a void so absolute, so devoid of being, that it outdoes any other terrifying aspect of the universe. The universe is full of wonders and horrors alike. But the most terrifying thing is the concept of absolute nothingness. A void where even the concept of being ceases.